Some great temps and some great temps tonight for maybe a ball game as the Diamondbacks return to Chase Field today for their fifth game of the World Series and fans have traveled from across the state to witness tonight's big game, including our very own Sean Mooney. I see fans behind you and I hope everyone is enjoying Phoenix right now as we root on the D-back Sean. <gasps> Monica, it is a beautiful night here in Phoenix. They have the roof open here at Chase, and there are a lot of fans still out here. We're about 45 minutes from the first pitch. Look at all those people. A sea of fans, and the D-backs are certainly going to need them tonight. The Rangers, as you probably heard, are tremendous on the road, at least in postseason. They've run 10 straight, so the Diamondbacks are going to need every single one of those voices here tonight. They're not giving up. And uh, I know that Cristiana Ramos has been uh, out there today, been here all afternoon. I want to bring her in now because you've been milling around some of these fans. What is the, the feeling, the electricity that we see out here right now? Well, they're obviously still confident in their team. They're showing up for their team out here. The excitement is still much in the air along with the winds out here. It's gorgeous out here. Uh, but what I did find out is ticket prices actually did go down. So I think there oh, are a boy. lot of so fans. There are a few who are giving up. That's not good. giving up already. No. Yeah, so ticket prices have went down. Yesterday I checked StubHub and it was about 700 to $11,000 depending on where you're sitting. Today, yeah. ticket prices are half that price. The 700 oh. went from 360 Now, so many great stories out there. I know you talked to a lot of people, both D-back and Ranger fans, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, Ranger fans, they're confident they're going to win today. Yeah. D-backs fans, they're pretty confident too. They really want to pull through, but regardless of a win or lose situation. We did talk to some fans who just really were excited to be a part of a World Series, getting to see, watch their team play in over 20 years. We talked to somebody. She said that she got married back in 2001. She missed the World Series, so she owes it to her husband. They're here today. Let's take that sound and let's hear what they had to say. Proud to be in Arizona. You know, we, we deserve it. We, we've earned it. And everybody that comes here will know about Phoenix from now on. Game one of the 2001 series was my wedding day. We missed the entire 2001 series, and for 22 years, my husband has said I owe him a World Series. I'm here to pay that off today. Wouldn't that be oh, a great wow. wedding present? Well, it would be, uh, and they need that one. But so many great stories with these fans, and they are here tonight. They're not giving up on the Diamondbacks, and they have a chance here to, to get back in it get back to Texas and uh, maybe win it all. So it's not over yet. It's not over yet. I'm excited to see what they do today. I really think they just got to go with those runs, get those hits in. All right, we'll see what's uh, going to happen. We're live from Chase. I'm going to send it back to you, Monica, for a bit.